Hey students, welcome to the video lecture of an external variable examples. So in this example, we are going to use the keyword extern. Uh, the extern keyword actually used to explicitly declare a variable in the extern class. And uh, it is a, a declaration, not a definition. Okay, we will discuss about this in detail. We'll directly go to the code block. I'm creating a file and save it in the name of extern keyword demo. I'm including a file ash include stdio.h, which is responsible for the, the input output function, print up and scan of void main. So I'm declaring a variable integer x here. Okay, it is in the file, it's in the same file. X and keyword demo one C file, it is declared the same file. So what I'm doing now, okay, in, I'm telling the, in the main function, I'm telling extern integer x, I'm declaring it. That means the integer x is a, de, uh, is a declaration and definition. That means that the declaration means x is a variable and the data type is integer, that is when I say declaration. Definition means, okay, the four bytes of the memory will be allocated. I'm using the extern keyword that I'm telling the compiler that, okay, the variable integer x is already somewhere declared inside the, the same file. That means the extern keyword demo one file and you have to use that variable. This is only a declaration, not a definition. Okay, again, a memory cannot be allocated. The integers cannot be duplicated. In this way, we are able to save the memory. And I'm initializing a value x equal to 10. Initializing a value x equal to 10. I'm printing a value print of x equal to percentage d because x is an integer variable. Okay, the percentage d is a format specifier and equal to percentage d x. What it will do? It will print the string x equal to percentage d. It will take, it will replace the first integer value after the comma. So x value will be replaced. So the, this is a, a simple use of extern keyword. What we are doing, I am declaring a variable integer x, okay, not within the main, okay, but within in the same file of extern keyword one dot c demo. And I instruct the compiler that within the main, I am declaring a, a line extern, int, uh, extern integer x. So within this, I am telling the compiler that the integer x is already uh, declared somewhere else. Where it is declared, it is declared in this place, okay, somewhere already declared and use it. That means that, okay, the same variable will be used, but we are explicitly declaring integer x is a global variable for the function main. I'm initializing the value x equal to 10 and I'm printing the result, okay? Now we will uh, run the program and check the result. Yes, we got the result x equal to 10, okay? X equal to 10. So one more point, point I want to tell you, you should not use the initialization during the declaration. For example, if you initialize the way, try to initialize the variable here, it will show an error. Okay, I'll run, uh, just see the program. What I'm doing that, I am initializing the variable in this place. Okay, if I run the program again, it will show a show an error. Okay, you cannot initialize the uh, value during the extern, uh, extern declaration. Again, running the program, it will show an error that, so error, x is both extern and insulator. You cannot insulate that in this place. So where do you have to insulate? You have to insulate it in the separate line. You should not insulate it in the in the, the same the declaration page. Extern text. Okay, I'm telling that. Okay, x is a variable already somewhere in this file. And and I asked the compiler, you will treat it as a global variable for the function main and use it inside it. Okay, then I'm giving x equal to 100. Now it will work. So run the rerun the program again, I check the result. Okay, my result is x equal to 100, okay. In this way, we can use this uh, keyword, extend keyword by explicitly making a variable as a global variable, which is declared somewhere within the same file, okay. Uh, then we can say that, okay, what kind of information give our, we are giving to the compiler here? Just information, we are informing this place. We are, with the statement informs the compiler compiler that the variable 
variable x is defined somewhere else somewhere else and okay and use it again as a global variable so in this space this is a global variable this is a global variable okay so it's inform the compiler that variable exists defined somewhere else and use it again okay so this is a global variable so what it will do it is only the external integer exists only the declaration not a definition integer x is a declaration and definition declaration means the x is a variable data type is assigned to the variable x the definite actually the definition means the four bytes of memory is allocated here the variable is reused so the memory is not allocated again in a separate place so it saves the memory also okay uh, that's it for this video lecture thanks for watching it